Let's keep that going. Big round of applause, Kelsey Kane. Um, I'm pretty young, uh, but I feel like all of my friends are just like, oh, I'm going through a quarter life crisis. <laughs> and I just think it's so adorable, they think they're gonna live to be a hundred. <laughs> like, you're clearly at least one third through. <laughs> my grandmother is 75. There's no way she has a quarter left. <laughs> Every time I go to her house, she just asks me which of her things I like. <laughs> and then has me write my name on the back to make sure I get it during all the confusion. <laughs> my family's pretty good. Uh, <laughs> I have one of those moms that makes me feel like completely loved and also like I somehow don't deserve that love. You guys got moms? Relatable. When I was 12, my mom gave me the advice that if I was ever proposed to by a man that I didn't want to marry, that I should just say yes and then see how I feel about it later. <laughs> because that's what she did. <laughs> I was raised really religiously. Uh, does anyone else have mixed feelings about morality? <laughs> um, where I was from, my youth pastor had this saying. It was, keep your head straight and the rest of you also straight. <laughs> I'm straight uh, by choice, of course, but <laughs> when I was younger, I thought it would be like a fun way to trick my mom into not being homophobic by telling her that I was gay. And she said, I guess I always knew. You were always so tall and good at math. Those aren't gay stereotypes. That's nothing. And then she went on to say, the rest of the family also thinks you're gay. We just like didn't want to say anything. And while my self-esteem was at an all-time medium, I just didn't have it in me to tell her that I was lying because at that point, I was the only gay person she had ever met. Just like, didn't want to give them a bad rap, you know? Be the ally. Uh, I actually have a boyfriend. Surprise, surprise, mom. We're celebrating uh, because I just got my period. I want to thank you guys so much. Half of you know what I'm talking about. The other half is like, please stop talking. <laughs> um, I'm celebrating it because I keep telling my mom I'm pro-choice, but I really don't want to have to prove it. <laughs> You liked it the most. I like you the most. <laughs> I always tell my mom, don't worry, I'm definitely going to adopt because I don't want to get fat and my boyfriend is ugly. <laughs> uh, you guys are like an Austin crowd. Do you guys just live here or you guys smoke weed? <laughs> so like a little bit of both, love it. <laughs> Do you guys ever feel like whenever somebody says, hey, you smoke weed? What they really mean is, I smoke weed, and I'm trying to decide whether or not I like you. <laughs> um, as you guys can clearly tell, 
I am not cool when I get high. 